Hello and welcome once again to Cities Skylines. So after all of the work we've been doing with our transport system, uh, it does seem like people are getting around the city a lot easier. Um, there are a few abandoned buildings and stuff still, which I'm a little worried about. But eventually they will fill up, I hope, um, as the houses actually fill up. Well, actually, it looks like the houses are full up. Mm. But yeah, they'll, they'll slowly start, you know, going to work, going to school, learning. But according to this, we need more industrial. So, I'm thinking new industrial zone around here. And if we take a look at our natural resources, we've got quite a bit of farmland just here. Or fertile land, as it says. So I'm thinking we turn some of this into a proper farm area. So that we don't sort of upset Pine Park, putting loads of pollution into the air. And we also sort of create some more jobs. So, for that we are going to need... A nice beefy road. Yeah, we'll go with one of you. Really wish. Can this overlay still be here? Oh, might be able to. Okay, that, that's good. What's that in the way? Um, looks like a burnt down building. Okay. We don't need you. Uh, resources, there we go. Now I know I'm making it an odd shape, but I don't see the point of using sort of more land than we need, so yeah. Right. And again with the stone in the way. Perfect size. It's going to end up as quite a large farm area, but I'm good with that. Large area means more jobs. Split that about halfway as well. Because we don't want the grid to be too long, otherwise, you know, a vehicle comes onto the road here and has to go right the way down just to turn around or something. Don't really want that. But yeah, that is a nice sort of large area, and that's another rock, isn't it? They really do get in the way, don't Okay, so, first off, turn all of this, um, this will be quicker, haha, all of it, lovely, so all of that area is going to be industrial, and then all of it is going to be a brand new zone I like 
following the roads for these because it makes them quite neat. Lovely. And we want this to be a farming zone. So only farming industries will be put here. And slightly increased tax income. Okay, nice. So, there we go. So, next thing we need is transport. So, we're going to go to metros once again, because these are probably one of my favourite transport types. And, of course, we've run out of money. That's what happens when I start building lots of stuff with a game paused. Doesn't end well. These are normal water pipes, aren't they? Rather than heated pipes. God damn it. Something seemed odd. I just couldn't put my finger on it. Then I realised they're the wrong colour. Right, you know what? Rather than waiting forever, let's take a loan. It's nice not having the loans, but you know. It's also nice being able to take one whenever I need it. Okay. Now we're obviously going to need power as well. into there for power, water we've sorted, and right, transport. See, so yeah, if I have it every two, just to sort of complete it. And wow, I've already run out of money again? That's ridiculous. Right. Are you guys... Oh yeah, of course, I didn't extend the water down this far. Because I'm an idiot. the nature of what this area is, uh, because it's just sort of a workplace, it's going to be very rare that people are going to want to travel, say, from this stop to this stop. So what I'm actually going to do, I think, is go from, say, here, and come straight off.
Anytime now. Curves work is really weird sometimes in this game. Fine, you know what? Just go with a straight line then. There we go. So, what we're going to do is go from here. All the way up to here, then back like that. And where are we then? Change this thing's colour so I don't get confused. Then same thing down here. Nice circular lines. I just messed that up. Back down here. There we go. See, that's why you change its colour. Easy to notice when you mess up. <clears throat> so. You can be yellowish. You can be reddish. And you can be sort of pink. Purple, I think that ended up more as, but yeah. So hopefully what will happen is, anyone that wants to go to this farm zone will jump on a train down to this station here, and then jump on a train along one of these routes to wherever they want to go. Don't know if that system will work well, or whether it will just clog up this station unbelievably. Not really tried a station like this before. Uh, this station is definitely full as hell. So... We'll see what happens. Although they do seem to be using this second platform rather than that side, so that's always a good thing. Wow, we are definitely getting a lot of users of the Metro, aren't we? I am not complaining about that in the slightest. And I know these are complaining of no power, but as more buildings are built, they'll end up with power eventually. <clears throat> now, I think we can do with a couple of recycling zones around here as well. Because, let's face it, this lot is going to generate some waste, and it needs to go somewhere. And I don't really fancy having it in a landfill, so... Maybe I should put power lines just for the moment because it doesn't seem to be uh, spreading that quickly does it? Now we get these ones happy. Right, we'll do that just for now just so sort of the buildings don't start disappearing but eventually we'll come back and delete those. Yeah, so, uh, Fawn District is up and running and getting workers, so, always good. 
Now, after building such a massive um, farming area or industrial area, we are definitely going to need more houses. So, that'll be the next thing. Uh, I would also like some fire departments around here because, uh, you know, near a forest and farms, so probably a good idea to have a fire department in the area. I wouldn't mind a police station either. Just to make sure that crime doesn't become a problem in this area. Not saying it will, but if we can minimise the possibility of it becoming a problem, I don't have to worry about it later. Ooh, this area needs a police station as well, really, doesn't it? Wow, that made people happy. And helped a single road. Only Hannah, a police station helps that single road at a time. Ooh. See, that's the problem with making your roads too long. The police can't even get to all of them. Wow, so many happy people that I'm putting police stations down. How about education? Wow, the education's poor here. Let's have a schoolhouse. And wow, we really don't have enough schools actually. We've really let education sort of drop, haven't we? getting it up again but it's still not good high school and wow university is so bad do we even have one like wow we have no money to build one I know that much put one there right next to the metro There really is no schools around, is there? So we've got two high schools and we've got no universities. Wow! I really just sort of missed that, didn't I? So I've been adding housing constantly and no schools. Whoops. Look at all the lorries. What the hell is happening? Um, let's follow this lorry and see exactly what it does and where it goes. It's exporting forestry products, so it's just going to leave. Okay. Well, if that's the case, maybe it'd be a good idea, just like we've got up here, to have another train station down here to take this stuff, because then this road wouldn't look like this. That is ridiculous. In fact, I'm going to do something about that. So we're going to have a one-way road from here. Straight onto the motorway. And a one-way one road from here. 
thing. But now I do want it from there. Mm. Okay, maybe up here. So that's two extra one-way roads onto the motorway, which will hopefully clear it out a bit. So by doing that, hopefully, we'll clear some of this traffic out, although a lot of it isn't going in the right direction, so... Right. We'll also take a road from here... over this road. Really? Come oh. Damn you. going where I want it. Seriously, just there to there. Space occupied by what? That's what I'm trying to join to, you idiotic road. No, no, not on the ground. There and then join. There we go. Then we go standard motorway. Standard motorway. Good, good. So this will hopefully clear some of the traffic off of this junction because wow that's ridiculous at this point especially now it's getting extra traffic from down here wow we need to do something about that yeah look we've got some lorries going that way now why are you trying to turn that way that it's a straight carry on road like there is no turn. Wow, look how bad it is. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. Right, okay. So let's get a train stop down here to try and alleviate some of the traffic up there because that's just bad. So we need a cargo train, we need a road first. So get a bit of road, come out to about there. then grab a train station to go right there. is where we're going to leave the episode guys so uh, hopefully in the next episode we can sort some of this traffic problem because holy god that's just bad like really really bad uh, but thank you very much for joining me guys please like comment and subscribe and I shall see you next time